Everybody. So this video is going to be a little bit different. I just wanted to let you know that I recorded this February 15th of this year. So this video is almost two months old. I really didn't know when was the best time to share it with y'all. Um, but it's no better time than now, y'all. So here it is. Y'all. If you've seen the title, then you already know what this is about. It's like, I cannot win for losing. I don't understand, like, why do this keep happening to me? I don't, I don't, like, I guess that's not a good question. Be like, well, you know, the whole, like, woe is me. But, like, seriously, it's too much at this point. I'm really getting symptoms and feelings, like, I could possibly be pregnant again and my thing is I, I just I can't take any more with the pregnancies like it's just it's too much I mean honestly my last pregnancy was easy like I wasn't sick I didn't throw up I didn't have morning sickness I was fine like I didn't get that big the delivery the actual delivery itself went smooth the only problem I had was you know finding a, a hospital bed but the actual delivery like it didn't even barely hurt like you know what i'm saying it was it was an easy experience like you know what i'm saying but still who wants to constantly be pregnant year after year after year after year but my only thing is like okay the symptoms i'm having is like i keep burping i feel like that's one of the symptoms because after being pregnant twice i'm you know i'm starting to get hip to what the main symptoms are and it's like I keep burping a lot, and I'm not a type of person that burp. Like, I'm real, you know, kind of like ladylike, and I don't burp all over the place. Or if I do, it's like, oh, excuse me, you know what I'm saying? But it's like I keep burping. Um, I just, I don't know, I just feel like my stomach just feel like even when I eat, it's just like I be hungry a lot. I just been like craving foods and just like being hungry. And I mean, I haven't gotten my period, but that's because of these dumbass birth control pills, which I stopped taking because I didn't need them no more because, you know, Mr. Somebody is not around no more. So it's like, what do I need them for? But I mean, I was in, like, I was inconsistent with taking them. I don't know. Like, it, it, I just, I don't know. I, I really don't know and then it's just like if i am pregnant like how am i how am i gonna deal with that because i mean i don't know it's just a hard subject to even talk about because that's you know that's a touchy subject that ain't even nothing really you bring to the internet but it's, it's just the fact of just like i know people be going through this i know they do it can't be just me it can't be just me but i just like I'm just so tired of it. I just wish I would not keep being in this situation. And I know that I'm the one putting myself in this situation. But at the same time, it's just like, come on. Like, how do you get pregnant that easily? That's my thing. Like, it's people out here who can't even get pregnant. You know what I'm saying? It's people out here who they try and try and try and try. And it's just like, it's not working for them. And here it is, me. Like, I'm not trying. I'm not trying. You know what I'm saying? I might have one wild night and then here i am pregnant again and it's just like come on like i, I can't have a little fun and then it, it just like I, I just i don't understand and then based on our relationship y'all know we we're not even really together right now which you know in the long run maybe i'm really hoping we can work it out you know what i'm saying but like right now we're not even together so i just like i don't even know i don't know i don't know and it's not even his decision. It's, it's it's my decision. You know what I'm saying? Don't really have nothing to do with him. Because at the end of the day, whatever I choose to do is my choice. But it's just still the simple fact, like, you know, he, he played a part in this too. So I would like to hear, you know, how he feels about it. But, you know, he probably, he probably won't even answer my calls right now because we got into it recently 
um a couple days ago and i really made him mad so he really not he really don't want to talk to me right now y'all i'm talking about i really pissed him off um because he got to do better you know what i'm saying he i be making him mad because it's like no you got to do better i'm not finna keep just accepting the bs you know what i'm saying i'm not a doormat like i hear what you're saying but no like no enough is enough like no we're not finna keep doing this and the fact that i won't just go along with the okie doke it he's he really mad he really upset now um but y'all it's raining in atlanta and i got my hair wrapped and flat ironed and stuff so i don't want it to get wet so i put my little thing on or whatever to, to come outside but <sighs> y'all i'm i'm low-key depressed I, I just wanted to put this video out because i'm gonna be honest y'all i don't know what i'm gonna do but i i don't want to just keep pushing out videos while i'm dealing with this because i just don't i just want to just like really this this video is to let y'all know like if i'm disappear it, it's because i'm really dealing with a, a lot at this point now here it is i just had a baby the baby my baby is only two months old he's gonna be three months old in a couple of days and now here it is i might be pregnant again and i really feel like i am because for one i haven't got my period but for two i keep burping a lot and then for three like my stomach it just feel weird it look big again and i don't know it's it's too much i know my my mom and my family just gonna be like it's exhausting you know what i'm saying it's it's exhausting it's exhausting for me i mean y'all think it's exhausting for you it's exhausting for me so to even try to tell anybody it's like i don't even want to tell nobody you know what i'm saying i, I really don't but at the same time i don't want to go through it all by myself either you know what i'm saying so that's why i'm making this video because it's just like i'm just at a point now like i don't i don't even have anything to lose i really be going through a lot and i don't want to keep it to myself you know what i'm saying i don't i don't want to keep it to myself <sighs> and i'm just tired like seriously of even putting myself into these positions i don't understand like god why i you can't even it's like you can't even ask that it, i just kind of feel like i'm like i'm too old to to not go through with it you know what i'm saying like but i i don't know i don't know i feel like i just i don't know it is is i'm i feel like i'm in a tough spot i feel like i'm in a tough spot and like whatever decision i choose to make i just want people to be supportive you know what i'm saying whether if you agree with it or not it's just like mm. I'm just so tired, y'all. Like, I swear to God, let me. If I'm pregnant again, like, come on. You talking about stair step? That is ridiculous. Three kids in three years? It's it's just too much. It's it's really it's really draining at this point. I take my eyelashes off. But um, y'all, like I said, um, it, I might have one more video after this one me taking a little test or whatever but i don't know i just i just i don't it's too much it's too much mm, i'm just i'm at a i'm just more like at a more spiritual place where i just feel like you know if god brought you to something he could bring you through it you know what i'm saying i, I really really feel like that so i can't feel like that on one hand and then do do some opposite on the other hand you know it's that's that's what's really so hard because i i just i don't feel you know to terminate would be the best thing to do you know what i'm saying i don't i don't think it's the right thing to do but i don't know if that's an emotional standpoint i'm trying to think about it practically because practically speaking you know that would be a good option so i just i don't i'm like i don't know i don't know i don't even know what to think I really don't, you know, but at the same time, um, these are my, you know, years to have kids, you know, in 10 years from now or 20 years from now, I won't be able to have no kids. So here it is now I have an opportunity. Do I want to throw it away or, you know, it, it's so mean. I just, I'd be thinking about so many different things like we, to make this type of decision, but, um, 
Yeah, I, I don't know because even the two kids I have now, you know, going into it at first, I didn't I didn't know how I was gonna do it. You know what I'm saying? I didn't know like based on my situation, I didn't know how I was gonna do it, what I was gonna do. But I just, I didn't think about that. I was just like, you know what? I'm gonna go through with it. And whatever happened, it happened. And, and, I, and I'm gonna just let, it's like I've been walking on faith. You know what I'm saying? I've really been walking on faith this whole time. And it's working out. You know what I'm saying? It, it's working out. Like, I don't feel like I'm struggling. I, I feel good. Like, you know what I'm saying? I'm happy with my decisions. And I don't, so that's why it's like with this time, like, I don't want to make a decision and then feel bad about it and be regretting it and be somewhere sad and like, wishing and you know what i'm saying thinking like oh you know so y'all mm, mm, mm. but it's kind of bringing me down that's why it's gonna be it's hard for me to just like do other content videos and do vlogs and stuff because my mind is really in a, in a different place right now i'm just like i don't know what to think at this point so <sighs> but anyway um I'm going to just see y'all on the next video. And if you if you have not subscribed to my channel, if you new just for this video, make sure you subscribe. Give me a thumbs up, y'all. Get Send a prayer up for me um, because, like, it's, it's, it's getting real out here. Like, for real, for real, for real, for real.